Okay, take one. You have to give me your time and I can give you experience. In the first room, we have seven magnet structures, seven gates. Without sound, they're concentrated to what they're going to see and what they're going to experience. Kind of silence, kind of in-between space that you can really collect yourself. We ask real trust from the public. We ask facilitators to take your hand and to move you through the space. In the next door, you have portal. So this portal is made with selenites and produce very, very bright light. So this is a kind of experience of change. You go from darkness to light. I didn't want to be a celebrity. It's the public put me in that position. And this really actually completely break their own concentration on their own personal experience. So I become obstacle to my own work. I see removing myself from this is very important. This is just a new phase in my life. The really change came with artists is present. I spent three months, you know, 715 hours sitting on the chair without motion. I understood how bubbly much need to be part of something. And I realized when I stood up from the chair that my work right now is the public. Public now is ready to be part of it, to actually experience it in a very direct way. The first time I came to do the performance in the museum, it was a piece called Dragon Head. And then later on in 1995, I came with full exhibition here in Oxford. This time I'm here again with another kind of exhibition based on research in Pete Rivers Museum and it's called Gates and Portals. In so many ancient cultures, there is so many gates and portals, different divisions between good and bad, paradise and hell, between life and death. The portals is really going through something that you change your consciousness, you step into a different state of mind, or you go between life and death. I studied the past, I can really create the future. As much time you invest, as much experience you get. Because the moment you open yourself, it's emotional. It's a work. It's a work on yourself. The only change can be done if you make your own personal journey. And this exhibition is about own personal journey. People should not be afraid of their own emotions. They should really go for it. <laughs>